We're going to explain how to find your IP address for Terraria Multiplayer. This is crucial if you want to host a Terraria game for your friends to join. There are a few ways to do this depending on your operating system and network setup. 1. Finding your IP address on Windows. The easiest way is through the Windows settings. Open the Start menu, type CMD to open the command prompt, and type ipconfig. Look for IPv4 address under your active network adapter, usually Ethernet or Wi-Fi. This is your local IP address, which your friends will need to connect to your Terraria server. Important note, this is usually only usable for local network connections. You'll need a different IP for players outside your home network, as described below. 2. Finding your public IP address for online multiplayer. Your public IP address is your address visible to the internet. This is necessary if you're hosting a game for friends who aren't on your local network. There are several websites that can provide this information for free. Simply search online for, what is my IP address? Many websites will immediately show you your public IP address. Copy this address. This is the one you'll need to give your friends to connect online. Three, understanding the difference. Your local IP address is like your house address on your street, while your public IP address is like your city address. Only people on your local network, your home, can use your local IP address to connect. To play with friends outside your home, they need your public IP address. Four, port forwarding for online multiplayer. This crucial step is often overlooked, especially when playing online. When you host a Terraria game, it uses a specific port number, usually UDP port 7777, but it can vary, to communicate with players. Your router might block incoming connections on this port by default. Port forwarding tells your router to forward any traffic on that specific port to your computer. This is essential for friends outside your local network to connect successfully. The exact steps for port forwarding vary depending on your router model, so you'll need to consult your router's manual or search online for instructions on how to port forward a specific port, usually 7777 for Terraria. This often involves finding your router's IP address, logging in, and configuring the port forwarding settings. 5. Sharing your IP address with friends. Once you have your public IP address and have successfully port forwarded, if playing online, give this information to your friends. They'll need to enter it into Terraria's multiplayer menu to join your game. Remember to also tell them the port number if it's not the default one, 7777. Ensuring they have the correct information is key to a successful online Terraria session. Remember, if you're playing only with people on the same local network, same Wi-Fi, you only need your local IP address. If you are playing online with friends on different networks, you absolutely need your public IP address and you should port forward the necessary port, usually 7777.